From the students of Penn State Meteorology, here is your Penn State Campus Weather Service forecast. Good afternoon, Central Pennsylvania. I'm student meteorologist Jacob Morris here with your CNET forecast. And it was quite a blustery day out there today with sustained winds in excess of 30 miles per hour, some gusts over 50 miles per hour, some power outages throughout the state. The good news is that those winds will be diminishing as we go throughout the overnight hours tonight. Here's a live look outside at Mount Nittany. We're seeing a mix of sun and clouds throughout the region. Our temperatures have been decreasing throughout the afternoon hours today. Now into the upper 50s, we we're in the 60s earlier in the day today. Those winds out of the west-northwest currently sustained at 26 miles per hour. Sustained winds throughout the entirety of Pennsylvania, anywhere from 15 to 35 miles per hour right now. It's a very breezy afternoon out there throughout the, the Keystone State. Wind gusts, um, especially in central and eastern PA, are very strong right now. Wind gusts at 35 miles per hour within the last hour in State College. 40 to 45 miles per hour wind gusts in eastern PA. The strongest wind gust I saw in State College was 52 miles per hour at around uh, 3 p.m. this afternoon. So some strong winds causing some power outages across the state. 81,000 customers currently without power right now. But as I mentioned, we'll be seeing some gusty winds over the next couple of hours before the, wi the winds diminish tonight. That's why the National Weather Service has a wind advisory only in effect until 6 p.m. this evening. For central PA, a high wind warning also in effect for the next couple of hours in the south central part of the state in the Laurel Highlands. Check out these temperatures in central PA. A uh, pretty big gradient from northwest down to southeast where they're in the low to mid 40s up in the northwest plateau and up by the Lake Erie shoreline. Into southeastern PA, they're seeing temperatures right now in the 70s near 80 degrees. And Philadelphia, as well as in Allentown, they broke their record high temperature for today. Philadelphia's old record high was 75 degrees, and they reached the low 80s today. Pretty remarkable for this time of year. Here in central PA, we'll be seeing our temperatures continue to decline tonight, but they'll make a big rebound tomorrow, a nice mild day to start off your weekend. Radar and satellite imagery across Pennsylvania shows no precipitation right now. Some clouds in central and northwestern PA as that storm system that brought the cold front through our area last night is now lifting off to the north and east, bringing some showers and storms to northern New England. There was actually a few severe thunderstorm warnings in northern New York as well as in um, uh, Vermont and New Hampshire earlier this afternoon as this low pressure system is tracking up into that part of the country. But notice for our weather off to our west, not a whole lot happening right now in the Great Lakes region. We'll be seeing some calmer conditions, the winds diminishing, as well as some sunshine for the first half of your weekend. Check out how these wind gusts really diminish tonight, uh, calming down nicely. So by the time you're waking up on Saturday morning, no issues for any more uh, wind damage caused by these very strong winds or your trash can blowing down the street or anything like that. It looks like it'll be a calm day on Saturday in terms of the winds as well as for the day on Sunday, but Saturday will definitely be the pick of the weekend as you'll be seeing on future weather as we time this out for you. Some more sunshine throughout the day on Saturday. Maybe a few high clouds in our area by Saturday afternoon, but a nice day to do anything outside if you do have that planned. Then on Sunday, a uh, storm system approaches us from the west. We'll see some periods of rain, especially throughout the afternoon hours here in central PA as the system pushes off to the east and into New England. Cooler conditions expected for Monday and Tuesday of next week, albeit with some nice sunshine on both days. Then we have to pay attention to another storm system that will move into our area for the middle portion of next week. Tonight, we'll drop down to a low of 45 degrees, mostly clear skies with those winds diminishing rather quickly. Tomorrow, a high reaching 67 degrees, pretty nice for this time of year, mostly sunny skies, about 15 degrees above average. And then looking at your seven-day forecast, Sunday, we have to deal with those periods of rain, so Saturday is certainly the pick of the weekend. Monday and Tuesday both feature sunshine, but cooler temperatures. And then that next storm system Wednesday and into Thursday, it'll uh, feature a very strong cold front that could allow for some wet snowflakes to mix in on the back side of the system, but much cooler for the second half of next week. For the Penn State Campus Weather Service, I'm student meteorologist Jacob Morse. Have a great weekend.